Hello and welcome. This is Jeet Dolakia and you're watching is Tomorrow News. Typhoon Hegebis is weakening but still a danger for Japan. Typhoon Hegebis is weakening but remains a powerful Western Pacific Ocean tropical cyclone and is likely to become the second formidable typhoon in just over a month's time to strike Japan including Tokyo this weekend. Hegebis was centered more than 600 miles south of Tokyo as of Friday morning local time and was category 4 strength according to the US Joint Typhoon Warning Center. Hegebis has previously been a super typhoon, a term given to typhoons with estimated maximum winds of at least 150 mile per hour for 78 hours since rapidly intensifying Sunday into Monday. Hegebis is a large tropical cyclone. Two Rugby World Cup matches have been cancelled in Japan as the country prepares to be hit by a super typhoon with a potential to cause widespread damage from torrential rains and high wind speed. Typhoon Hagibis, which means speed in Filipino, had sustained speeds of 270 km per hour early on Thursday along with strong gusts. Speeds are expected to fall before it makes landfall in the Tokyo region over the weekend. Hagibis is moving north-northwestward but it will make a call toward the north and northeast Friday into Saturday, putting it on a collision course with Japan's largest main island, Honshu. The typhoon will make weakening as it nears Japan because it uh, increasingly unfavorable upper level winds, drier air and cooler sea surface temperatures. That said, Hegbis will still be a strong and dangerous typhoon as it makes its call closest pass Saturday into early Sunday local time. If Hagebis makes landfall over southern Honshu, a dangerous storm surge is also expected with the arrival of Hagebis and it would be highest to the east of the center along coastal areas facing the Pacific Ocean and in smaller bays opening to the south. If its center turns sharper and tracks just to the east of Honshu, the surge threat would be lower but some coastal flooding would still result ahead of the typhoons passing. Heavy rain is expected to trigger flash flooding and mudslide, particularly in high terrain. These impacts could begin in southern Honshu as soon as Friday night local time given the size of Hegebis and the large ocean swells it has already generated. Hegebis is poised to strike Japan just over a month after Typhoon Faxai hammered Tokyo and Chiba prefecture, damaging 34,000 buildings, knocking out power to 9,30,000 homes, snarling air and rail travel and causing over a half billion dollars in agricultural damage according to the officials. Hegebis is the 19th named storm of the year in the western pacific ocean according to digital typhoon. That's all for now. For more news updates stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news. Jit Dolakia. For more weather updates like this, please subscribe to our channel.